Hello friends and fellow farmers. Mail slime is hatched and it's the 12th of the month. Not much going on. Friday. Hello children. So last time we got a pile of uh, smelt and down done. We gathered stuff. We put some uh, slime incubators in weird places. Hey Penny. I have to go into town today. Don't work too hard and also maybe stop putting slime incubators in people's houses because they are going to run us out of town. They are not. They're going to be overpowered by the, the joy and majesty of uh, what it is to be a slime parent. I think they're going to be incredibly pleased with, with the decision that I've made for them. I think that's the only conclusion I can come to. Okay, now we'll put these away. Uh, maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. I think she thinks I uh, Penny smart. Penny knows that people are going to get upset. I think the there's going to be a revolt. What do we got? James, fan your face down in the mud. Okay, Marlin. Okay, Mr. Smarmy Pants. That's fair. You did find me face down. Yes, you did. Yes, I will concede. I was face down in the mud once again. You don't need to rub it in. Uh, he's actually just doing a service. A void egg? The void salmon once in a while will give you a void egg. Huh. Bananas. Alright, let's put a few more things in here before we get on with the day. We got like... Yeah, I really just wanted to like get through one of my stacks of uh, copper. <laughs> that was my that was my dream here. Why it's weird? They take slightly different lengths of time, don't they? And you really do need a one-to-one -one ratio, I think, when you're uh, smelting down stuff, because you're waiting for so many things for so long. Okay, let's put some of this stuff away. Uh, I'll put the incubators there for the moment. The gold. 88 slime. Huh. Alright. Now we're still waiting on this. So I, I blew through about... I don't know. I, I'm not sure what it's going to be in the end. How many pieces of wood will I have burned through? I don't know. 26. Okay, so yeah. One more batch here and then we're good. Then we'll have blown through another pile of copper. We only have 2,000 more copper to smelt. <laughs> and we got 165 bars. So what is that going to yield us? Let's see here. That's 82 crab pots. That's a respectable number of crab pots, is what that is. Um, we have three more crystallariums we can do. And, uh, you know, bee houses, well, we need the copper for that. I don't feel like I was really in the market for too many other things. So I'm content with that. I mean, we are going to want to make more of our slime incubators at some point, but we need, it's mostly slime we need. It's not actually the uh, the other stuff that's the, the holdup on that. Okay, let's put this wood in here. Let's do this last batch. There we go. And then we can uh, check everything in here. What all goes in there? All right. That's a lot of crab pots. 85 crab pots in our possession. Uh, we could just, you know what? I'm gonna go to the door. No, it will wait. It's gonna be done gonna be done. There it is. Okay, we'll put this coal in here. You know what I will do is I will take this out and I will continue to destroy the environment though. I'll try and remember to do that. I should be really be doing this in the house like right by my bed so that we're a little bit more efficient at it. <laughs> Our efficiency at destroying the environment is it's not it's weak. Where we've got a weak method. Now I had this one more stick I'm gonna put in the... There we are. I guess while I'm at it I may as well pick up all of the... Uh, I don't really want the other stuff, but I do want the sticks. Wow, 179 wood, 100 and... 217 wood. That's pretty good. Uh, 
yeah, I, I think that's... This is all gonna kind of pay out, I think. I think once we get... Um, now we decide where else we want our crab pots. That's that's one of the big issues. I gotta figure out, like, where exactly do we want all the crab pots? Uh, you want it to be convenient, for one. Is there... There we go. Oh, my I don't have any slimes with me. Oh, bummer. That's fine. It's definitely going to be out of hand. <laughs> also, I yeah, realizing some of the ha these slimes hatching may have just been a matter of like... Yeah, so a lot of them don't seem to interact. I'm guessing it's just maybe the first one. And then does the... depending... like, does its name vary at all? I have no idea. I do not know. Haley, what are you thinking? You look like you've been doing a lot of hard work. Why don't you take the rest of the day off? I like the way you think, Hales. How's that? Yeah, that's gonna be good. So ideally, if I can... I don't know. Hopefully I can sort of keep them in your room. I don't know that that's gonna be the easiest. Okay. Where do we want to put these things? I'm... we've looped now around the entire, um the entire ocean area. That's done. I'm wondering if I should continue along now where I was kind of going closer to our house over by the lake. That might be a good one. Or down that ocean area. Or it could continue up here. Oh, we've got enough that we can actually do a respectable amount. 80 some is a decent amount. So I'm a, yeah, I'm a little torn as to which ones we want to do. Um... Yeah, this one was weird. This is a jagged coastline. It doesn't... It's, you can't get those nice clean swaths that you get over by the... Uh, down at the ocean. Some of that shoreline is nice. You get a big wide array of all the goodies. Alright, let's grab these ones. Yeah, I can't wait till the mayor's slime hatches. To see the, the overjoyed look on his face. It's just gonna be... So, I, I love bringing pleasure to people. Like, he's gonna be so happy. He's gonna be like, oh my gosh, this is like a box of chocolates and flowers. It's just like, it's so much happiness, so much joy. It's, his heart will, uh, it just explode with happiness. Uh, I'm not trying to kill him, but you know, we want him to be happy. So, this looks like a terrible area for crab pots. This looks passably good. I guess it comes and goes, doesn't it? Like, some of this will be really good. Those are a few good stretches. Um, I get, you know what, maybe I will do this one. We, we've come this far. I should just finish off regions. Okay. These, the bridges are good. Okay. Okay, that's not bad. Okay, oh good, so this bank here is so... Oh, okay, we can put them down, facing downwards on these. These are big enough ledges. Okay, so now we're just going to go up here. Okay, so now we can go across this way. Okay, and then we'll come down here. Okay, this is interesting, so... Wow, that's that's a nice... I don't think we're going to be able to put any along this section. It seems... Oh, we can, unfortunately. Okay. I was kind of happy with it not accepting anything. Okay. Yeah, that all looks too problematic. All right. Now. Yeah, okay, that's excellent. And then we got a few more here that we previously didn't get. There we are. Wow. Well, okay, that's actually did a huge amount of that. We still have more, but it's that's we're way farther into it than I thought we'd be at this point. That's not bad at all. So this project cleanup is definitely involved. <laughs> I, I really had no idea how involved this task would be. 
of trying to get all of the, uh, the stuff. I thought, you know, uh, it'll take a little while. I had no idea it would take this long. I really didn't. It's kind of... I, I, I'm glad it did, in a way. I've enjoyed this process. Once again, it... Well, you know, I think probably a hundred hours ago in Stardew Valley, I thought, where where am I going to go with this? Where are we going? What are we going to do in this? And it's funny how you you just kind of... You, fig, you make pro weird projects for yourself. It's like when you're a kid and you got to fill a bore, boring day. I don't know if it, that's as much of a thing anymore. I know my kids get bored. They don't, uh, I don't think they reach for weird projects. When I was a kid, it was all about weird projects. It's a different thing now. Now you can just easily placate yourself with technology or whatever. When you had to use pure imagination and n not many things, you came up with some weird stuff. <laughs> so I enjoy these kinds of projects, I think. It's just nice, ridiculous objectives. Not to say that a, not a young person doesn't. Just that it, my brain, I think, is grew, you, when you grew up in that setting in the 80s, you're forced to think a little differently. You, you, you go to is to come up with weird things, maybe a bit quicker. That's probably not entirely true. My daughter comes up with pretty weird stuff. Might be kid specific. There's lots of kids that didn't do weird stuff when I was a kid, so I guess that doesn't hold any water at all. Never mind. Generalizations. How are we doing on 10 crabs? Yeah, this whole crab cake, I gotta start, I, I guess, I'm just gonna have to start eating them more frequently. So, I mean, we've got like seven years worth of crab cakes now. I don't even know what they sell for. Is there, do they list the sell price in the uh, recipes here? Yeah, it does. Okay, let's see here. What do crab cakes go for? It's interesting that these are all empty spots. It doesn't just jump up. Uh, 275. Wow. Okay, well, even if I had 1,000, that'd be 275,000, so... Uh, which I don't. I have 200 and some extra. I guess at some point, it, you could make you can make a bit of money out of it. I don't know, that seems like a lot of work <laughs> for that much money. Just grow starfruit. But a lot of these things, it isn't about not trying to get rich, it's just that it's a byproduct of doing something a lot. It just works out to being cash in the end. Take you a long time to get a million dollars from crab cakes. Alright. We'll get this and then we'll pop on home. And then we'll see if we can recycle this wood again. And get uh, smelting down a bit more. We need more slimes over here. I'm wondering if the slimes reset at some point as well. Like if at, at, in the evening or the next day, did they kind of reset to their spawn point and then wander around? Because they don't seem to like get trapped. I don't know. I don't know if that's a thing. Okay, so let's get our 300 wood here. And we'll go and, uh, while we're waiting for that, come and get some recycling going, then we'll go check on it again. Alright, now what do we have here? 28 wood. Alright. Oh. There we are. I didn't want to change the song. What are we doing? Wow. It's way too many CDs. This tells me a lot about uh, consumer culture and uh, really what's floating out around out there. Oop, I missed one. Way too many CDs. Oh, uh, here we go. Too much dead media ending up in the river. Okay, so that one's going to be coming up in a second here. Come on. You got this. You got this. You can do it. You got this little, little smelter. Beautiful. Alright, 
There we go. Now we got more eyeglasses. The land of broken lenses. And there is some coal. I like that. Yeah, we got 15 coal. You know, that's, that's something, right? That's not bad. Okay, so let's, we'll leave that stuff there. We don't really care about that that much. And I'm not going to walk over to my, my bin. I'm just going to go here. I'm going to sell some of these things because they're... Why keep them? That's how lazy I am. I'm not walking over to the other side. We'll, re we'll reclaim $900 in those. We get a reasonable amount. Enough. I, I still don't remember. But somebody explained it to me at some point here. How much we get for the iridium thing. I really don't recall. Okay. Let's get in here. 260. So I got 25 coal again. That's not bad. Um, wow. Yeah, well, this is uh, it's actually not too bad at all. So it's it's kind of working out. Between the the wood we get that we recycle and then the um, the coal we get from the recycling, it adds up to a little bit. Like it's every time we're working here, it does feel like we're sort of reducing our. Uh, expenditures. How are these? Okay, why are these not stacking? There we go. And you. Alright. And then we've got another five Cool. There we are. And then these ones. So it's yet another, like, you know, whatever, 30 bars we've got. That's relatively quick. Yeah, and then, like I said, every time we do this, this process gets just incrementally faster. So, then another 5 bars. So that's like 2 more crab pots. So every run we're doing here is actually adding up quite nicely. 64 more wood, which means we can only do a couple more here. But it uh, that's not bad. I mean, we really didn't use up as much wood as we could have there. And that's kind of that. Alright, let's end that. So 40 more bars. We have 45 bars. And we're still at like uh, 3,000 wood. Is that what we're at? 3,000? So we used up about 1,000 wood. Uh, over this process. So we've made 85 and then we'll be able to make another um, 22. So about 100 crab pots we've built from that uh, that little amount there. Let's drink our espresso. It's 11 o'clock. Let's wander over into town again and we'll throw down these last few I think. Worth doing. May as well. Hey, little slimies. I wonder what they do when Pam's not there. They're like doing crossword puzzles. How are you doing? And see, they, yeah, they're still wandering around town. Just like... <laughs> listlessly. Just making waves in town. Okay, let's... Okay, so we can't put any here. That's fine. Can't put any there. Can't put any there. Okay, and we're done here then. Beautiful. All right, so that means the remaining ones will have to go up here. That's pretty good. And then we'll, yeah, we'll have a few to spread around up here. Nice. Okay, yeah, no, this is, uh, we're almost, what? Yeah, we are almost done. We got eight more here. I think we just did it. Oh my gosh, we did. That's fantastic. Okay, so we're, we've crab potted this area. Oh my goodness, and we still have two more to go. 
That's pretty cool. Okay, that's, uh, that took a lot. <laughs> and I probably could, I bet I could put like one more here, but yeah, I can, but my street light's in the way. Okay, so what I need to do is move my street light. Uh, sorry, street light. And I'm going to put you right there. I can't really ride my horse up anyway, so. And then these ones, same deal, you're in the way. Okay, and then we'll put you maybe like right there. And I can still get it, this one. Hey, there we go. Oh, I fell asleep in town again. All right, we will see you all next time. Till then, bye-bye.